hey orange one here so uh our character's got a little bit of a problem he keeps on getting knocked down to the floor he's really dizzy and that's been happening for a while now i think it's the amphetamine withdrawal i'm not 100 sure to be honest um yeah <laughs> i think we took too much adderall when we were trying to install the cbms basically so we're gonna have to take some days off with our character this is a pretty high fail chance I think we're gonna go for it yeah because we have our friend here i'm feeling confident enough and we're gonna have to take a break anyways um due to us like you know falling down con like continuously we're feeling tired yeah we've had so much um sensory doling today that we're probably gonna just uh Take the day off. I, I'm super excited for what's going to come next for Nosh. So basically, I want to mutate our friend here, Louie, into a bird mutant. Oh my god, the probability travel successfully installed. That is amazing. Yeah, anyways, Louie, I want to turn into like a bird mutant and then give him like a ranged weapon. I was thinking a bow, but he's kind of going to be weak for a bow if he's a bird mutant. So maybe like a crossbow. I we could go guns, but we're getting a little low on ammo. The one other option is like a coil gun and giving him the CBMs to charge his own UPS power and then power off of that. That is an option for us. And I, I have the battery powered. It might be nice to go UPS for me. But then I was also thinking it might be nice to put the UPS um, system on him. And also have him uh, be able to use like a coil gun. But I'm not sure if that would even work, to be completely honest. Um, so I think... I mean, I was thinking I wanted to have a UPS power myself and drain stuff from my own power instead of carrying around a UPS. So just because so we have to carry around a little bit less gear. I don't know. I think I think I'll leave it for now. I'm 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 debating it. I went and grabbed this and now I'm like not really sure. Um so we could run things directly off of this. I don't think I'm gonna install that on myself or my friend. Um let's just go ahead and get that aesthetic though. And our friend Louie, come with us. We are going. Yeah. We're really going to leave this doctor's office. And I think what I want to do is uh, make a syringe of adrenaline. Um, I saw that that's got to be around here. There's a power storage mark too. I should install that. Yeah. I'm being kind of lazy when I should install things. Uh, where was that one storage container that had plenty of space? This one right here. Go ahead and put that there. Also, we have mutagen. I forgot to mention that. Now, I don't think I'm going to be carrying around a lot of this stuff. Yeah, the chemistry set um, we're using for crafting. Oh, jeez. Can I run you over here? And then I'm gonna actually get the Jane out. Um, actually, yeah, get the Jane out. And we are pretty encumbered, but they're not grabbing us. And I'm just kind of curious. Uh, yeah, none of that's gonna help us. I was just double checking what biotics we had there for a second. I definitely do want more power though. That does seem like a good idea. Hey Louie, let's, let's go install this one more bionic. Um, actually while we're doing that, is there any... Sorry, we'll get rid of the heartbeat. I tried to adjust the volume on some stuff for you guys, I hope it's better. Hey buddy, are you coming in or what? There we go. Catch my breath. Mind if I get knocked to the ground a few times from my 
addiction or whatever. Pretty sure that's what's going on. It could just be the anesthetic that that's like a effect of it. Anything else? I could give him. I, I definitely do want to give him the joint torsion, because that would charge his power, and it's kind of like, what do I have him use the power on? I'm not really sure quite yet. I don't think he's gonna use the arrow evaporator to get water. Um, but we are just going to just take a second to mend this and get the that CBM a little bit more taken care of. Now we are going to need our washing kit, though, of course. Um, we are hearing stuff from our nor the northwest, but it's not repeated, so I'm going to just leave it be. Yeah, I think um, we'll, <laughs> we'll have our little cage songbird with us, Louie. Okay. And I wanted to also get a cattle mu mutant, and so we'll get one of the beggars to do that. So they'll turn from like this pathetic person who can hardly do anything to a walking tank, is basically my plan. Okay, yeah, I get that soap on there. And then I think <laughs> I need to get, um, whatchamacallit now those pouches that I just put down. Okay, a pouch. Yep. Activate that on this. Yep. And we're gonna um, dump that right here so they can get sterilized. Because I think we're gonna probably sleep here tonight is what I'm thinking. Oh, it's actually still bright out. Yeah. Louis, let's get you in here. And I'm actually going to do an operation on you for once. I know, right? That'd be kind of weird. We'll switch. Um, power storage. Oh, we need... Hold on, what? We need our anesthetic. Don't I have anesthetic? Isn't that what I was saying? It says 3% chance of failure, so we're going to be successful. Man, we can't even stand up, and we're going to perform an operation on Louis. He's very trusting of me. Uh, anesthetic. Here, we'll get that. we got to keep in mind that we're going to be limited on these installs for him. Because he doesn't have sensory dulling. We can actually make more anesthetic. I do know that's something that's possible in-game. There's a 3% chance we're going to fail, so it's guaranteed we're not going to fail. We'll have power. And then by the time that we're done with this... Um, 18 minutes. Okay, we can we can wait that long. We'll wait half an hour. Well, until like 9.30ish. Uh, no, just keep on waiting. Yep. Keep on waiting. And Louie, I think, should be able to walk. Yeah, he's behind us. That joint torsion racket should be in here somewhere. Yep. Yeah, it's it's actually working still. Um. Now what do we want to do? Well, while we're waiting, we could make some stuff. Don't think... Oh, there, there was that one zombie we killed, so we could try and make some uh, painted meat from him. Wherever that was. Where was that? It was, like, right here, right? Some tainted bone from him. <gasps> no way. I didn't even check this, but he's got a stand egg on him. Sweet. And hey, he's got some nice food for us as well. Thank you. I might be about actually bringing this guy into the uh, into the vehicle and then taking it apart in there. It's gonna take a little while, but we have the time. Okay, I think we're gonna want lights on for this and. 
Well, let me do a full butchery. Oh, we need a butchery rack. I think I have one of those somewhere around here. Oh, there's a... someone outside. Let's get our Jane out. And we'll just take care of that. Nice and quiet. Good. And come back in. It should be all shut now. Yeah, we're really, really messed up right now. You're bored so you stop waiting? I didn't even know that was the thing. That's pretty funny. <laughs> Man, I'm so boring that my Cataclysm character can't even wait. Uh, what was I doing? I was waiting for that to go... I can't even remember what I was doing. Something to do with food? Oh well, we have this food. We'll just have our entree nice and cold. And we are a psychopath character. Full right. Nice thing. <laughs> um, uh, what was it that I was going to do? I was going to butcher. Right, I was going to butcher that zombie. No, butchery rack. Southwest. Yep, we'll go ahead and get that, and then we're going to set that up, actually. Pick up this dude. Game's got to complain at us, but we're fine. I think we're going to need to have some light, huh? Yeah, I had a feeling that there was going to be some other zombies around, but the nice thing is, is that they're bringing us tainted meat, you know? Um, yeah, we're gonna need to have, like, a cool box, at the very least, and some light. But we'll need a flashlight and a toolbox. But if we can secure ourselves some mutagen and make a bird mutant that's semi-cybernetic, we're gonna have a very powerful companion. Um, what was I doing? Toolbox? Yep. Um, I've been wondering if I gave him the integrated tool uh, kit, if he would just like weld things for me. I don't think he will, but that should be something that you can do down the road, you know? Um, so we got our toolbox, and then we need a flashlight, right? Do I, I already have one. We should be okay. Um, unless, so I bet something sees us while we're trying to do this. That's gotta be the one issue, trying to do a full butchery with a flashlight outside, is that we are liable to be spotted. We're out of breath anyways, so we have a gun, it's fine. I can't stand, but I have a gun. And our bionic power has gone down a considerable amount. It makes me a little nervous. Don't take that down quite yet. Just take that. And then we'll dehydrate that. Uh, I do think we need the food dehydrator in our inventory, though. From what I remember. Hydrated, tainted meat. Let's just go for like an hour. And see how that goes. Hopefully that will get rid of that heartbeat sound in the progress. Oh, actually, hold on. Let's... Why is my craft not being crafted? I no longer have a nun. I thought I got the dehydrator. No, it doesn't look like I did. Just catch our breath. It's annoying me. I don't know if we'll ever really have our breath fully caught. How this is working for us, but getting closer, right? I do have the dehydrator on me. Why is this not working?
Yeah, I, I'm thoroughly confused. What if I reload said dehydrator? And I try and continue crafting, will that work now? No, it's not wanting to work for me. Man. What if I just do a singular one? Oh, it's because we're using the hot plate that's nearby? And that would be part of our issue. That is a strange issue for the game to have. Okay, we do have one that got made there. Um, the dehydrator, I think it's actually using the thing that's in our inventory. Hydrated meat. Yeah, it, it seems that the larger crafts uh, seem to be using the wrong tool or something. Oh, it's using the chemistry set. Joy. That's our problem. The chemistry set, which is like UPS powered or something. Yeah. Whoops. Wrong tool. That's my bad. Um, and do we have a UPS? We do. Okay. Hydrated. Let's do that. Uh... We'll do it for like an hour-ish, like we were saying we are going to do. And then it's getting to be bedtime. I don't know why our character is not tired. <laughs> Shut up, don't lie to me. Are you feeling I'm lying to you about bedtime, Nosh? <laughs> the tainted meat said, you can put me back together, right? Is that what we're trying to do? Trying to put the uh, blob back together into uh, some mutagen? We do have um, dehydrated tainted meat. We got actually six units of it. That's not half bad. Um, I would like to do more, especially seeing how we're not tired. We also, it looks like, have the ingredients for our own. Um, I was just looking at things. Uh, our own sandwich. We can make a nice deluxe sandwich, but I might do that in the morning because it'll give us a morale boost. We don't really need it, need it right now. And what we need is a little bit of charge and fix up our gear. I think also I want to make some uh, adrenaline syringes. We haven't had like a a plan B button up to this point. We've just like had a really strong plan A. And we've had like plan B in terms of weapons, but I think what we really need is um, have some like escape options like with uh, adrenaline and an adrenal pump would be nice. It's always a good one to get, but who knows? We'll see if we get that. Um, we do want to have a battery though. If I look at eating, can I look at a battery? use this because it's already got charge for us and then why don't you dump it back in there and then <clears throat> excuse me we'll turn this back on and I'm not really sure what to do from here I right, gotta take a quick break I'll be right back okay so let's see what was I doing I think I was yeah, I mean, it's kind of in the middle of the night, but I think if we can, we should try and make mutagen. Um, we could make some lizard mutant and fish mutants. I, I did not know the fish mutant got such an awesome ability as the electronic whatever we call it. I am... I did actually just save the game while I took the break there. Um, just wanted to make sure my mutagen didn't get wasted. Because we do have a chemistry set with... And my limited UPS charge. I think it should work. If it doesn't, then I'll debug it. Because it does drive me a little bit crazy how the game does that. Um, yeah, use our ammonia. We have 166 units of that, so I'm not really worried about that running out. It looks like the crafting is going off without a hitch. And we've got a whole gallon jug of mutagen. Don't, <laughs> don't worry too much about that. Um, could go make more. Oh, we just wasted our flashlight charge. Fine. 
Or was that other zombies that we just killed? You. No? Not you. You. We just killed. So we'll, uh, see what we can do with that. It is night, so it is a little bit colder, so their meat should last a little bit longer. So we should be able to get something from this. At least we know that the area is definitely clear, and if nothing's coming towards my my light while I'm out here butchering this, then I think that we're good. There's actually some tainted fat as well. I think you can make mutagen from tainted fat, right? Pretty sure. It looks to me like you're stopping to just fall over randomly. But I could be wrong. Uh, hydrated tainted meat. Here it looks like. Where's the chemistry set? Oh, the chemist. It takes the dehydrator and the chemistry set. Okay, well. That dehydrator. my east well I would like to have that on me let's just take a second and rearrange some stuff uh, bah, 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 bah. don't need that anymore or that and we're using that for the dissections not really using this or that, that. yeah that should be good now we should be able to get the dehydrator Here we go. Kind of interesting, it takes both a dehydrator and a chemistry set. Put that back, and then... Yeah, it takes a charge of both the chemistry set and the food dehydrator. I think that's part of what was throwing us off last time. We could do all 20 of these, but it's going to take 3 hours, 30 eight minutes. I think if we have the charge, let's do it. Because I'm gonna want the mutagen soon anyways, and our character's not tired. I think the um, anesthetic counts as like sleep for them, so yeah. We're probably not gonna need to sleep tonight is basically what I'm saying because we slept throughout the day in the last episode. I do like how we hear voices and see things that aren't really there. Our flashlight must be dead now, huh? Ignore the zombie unless they start smashing the car. And it's actually daytime now. Well, crafted all the way throughout the night. Please tell me this is, doesn't go rotten while we're making it. I bet it does. It says it's cold, though. I think because it's still the morning, we'll be okay. We'll see if this comes out wrong. If it does, then we just wasted like five in game hours. We didn't even sleep. Yeah, our flashlight just turned off. Hmm. I feel like we just wasted the time because we. This stuff's gonna go off. But we'll see. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Oh, it's not off. Sweet. Okay. Go ahead and. Put that away. We, okay, make more mutagen. We are going to want a lot of it. We're going to craft with it. We might as well craft a lot, right? Uh, chemistry set. Yeah, we got enough charge for that. Mutagen. Ten of those. I think that we have about enough mutagen if we wanted to make our bird mutant that we could do so all the way. I mean, we probably would want to upgrade him a little bit, uh, but we'll see. Get another gallon jug of mutagen going. Got our mutagen crafted pretty nicely there. We're going to need to go get feathers, and so I'm thinking next episode we'll just drive somewhere and get feathers, but for now we just need to get more mutagen. Um... Where was that other zombie? There was like another zombie that was like around the car. Is that Screecher coming towards us? Yeah, they are. Oh, well, just let them come all the way to us then. 
Why don't you come right next to the butchy rack, actually, friend? And we can just move you from there to there. <laughs> oh, nice, right? Super convenient. Uh, full butchery, sure. Their meat is more likely to go off because it's going to be getting warmer. We're comfortable right now just in our regular clothes, so you need to keep that in mind. I know I'm I'm super excited to test out my CBMs, and you guys I'm prob I'm thinking are probably as well also equally excited. Um, maybe we'll get to do that in the next episode. Just really kind of play around with them. It looks like we are past our addiction problem that we were having. We're just you know regular crazy, not a big deal. Um, like that. And while we're at it, we might as well just, uh, no, it's, we don't have enough, any charge for that. Never mind. Go ahead and replace that. Sure. Put it back there. We got a pretty good system going here. Once we make all this, man, we are going to be good. Well, it actually takes three hours, three and a half. I thought it said it took five last time. Maybe because we got better lighting or something? I don't know. I'm like legitimately confused about that. In any case, we are... We're looking pretty good. I'm liking things and we're getting near the half an hour-ish mark. Uh, ignore the zombie for now. I don't think they can see or smell us, so I'd like to just get this craft done. And end it with that. And then we'll just be chugging mutagen in the next episode. <laughs> Well, we won't be. Louie will be. We'll be turning him into singing Louie the songbird. <laughs> what do you think about that as an episode name? The songbird? I think the songbird. Yeah. It has a nice ring to it. And Louie will sing to us as we go around. We'll play our harmonica and he'll be like on vocals. It'll be great. You know? Who needs a... Uh, an mp3 player when you got the songbird as your companion <laughs> oh man I enjoy this game too much it worries me <laughs> okay so that's crafted onto the ground uh, we still have a lot of tainted meat on us I'm gonna just pick up what we can and It looks like up our northwest is open, so there's some spots for us to st put stuff good. And then I'm just going to make some mutagen, and we'll probably end it right then. Oh, we're running out of bleach. Oh, wow. So we're out of bleach. Okay, well, that changes things drastically for our game plan for the next few episodes, is that we're going to need to find some bleach. But I think we'll, uh, we'll go down the mutation line, and then we'll look for some bleach. In any case, thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.